I've got spare days now, so here is my garage. It's a beautiful garage, look at that, it's so well built. And um, the door's broken, you see, because it fell on my head. But anyway, so the project today is to clean it up, you see. So it's clean. Um, so, the next time I I record, the garage will be absolutely beautiful and clean. Right, I'm going to get serious now, look. I absolutely tore into it, and I cleared a space for my chair. Look at that. The trouble is, see, by clearing a space for my chair, I've had to leave all this stuff out there, you see. So, um, I haven't made a lot of progress, but anyway, I've got a chair so I can think about a strategy. So there. Like we, we do the time-lapse film, you know, about the tidying of my garage. This is uh, I go to be an epic. Look, look at the bee. It's a massive bee come in here. Ooh. Right, it's really taking shape now. Look at this now. Look, there's a bit of wait a minute. I show you it. There it is. Look, that is a clear piece of garage floor. It's, it's obviously, obviously, um, a bit more to do. But there's another bit there. Look, that's clear as well. Just want to sweep it a bit, and that's. Um, a fire extinguisher in case we have a fire. Yeah, so it's all coming along quite nicely. Now these were extremely delicious. They were very, very nice indeed, but they're all gone. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to put the raw plugs in them. Here's a little tip for you. Look, and I've got lots of them all over the floor. So I'm going to put them in here. So I might even change the label. I might put raw plugs in there instead of whatever it says on there. Look, this is a bungee I found on the floor. It is possibly the most dangerous thing in the world. You can lose an eye, and I'm sure people have, you know. Though I don't recommend them at all. Uh, I've come to a bit of a stop here because there's a bit of a mixture here. Here it is here. This is this is where I'm gonna put the raw plugs in here. But it's all mixed up, see? So I've come to a bit of a stop. Now as you can see, got lots to do. So and without further delay, I shall continue. Oh no, it's gonna take me forever. This is quite abstract, isn't it? I'm going to call it Broken Clock on Wellies and sell it for a fortune. It's coming along nicely now. Um, that, um, it's, it's all a question of categorising. Um, which is the biggest space I could make with the least effort? So I'm not quite sure which way to go. I could put stuff up there, which would leave down here empty. That may be the right way to go.
this is a Paul Elliott golfing tip of the day. Now, get yourself a tube. As you can see, as you can see, it is a tube made out of cardboard and um, tape. Now, place your arm inside it. Place your arm inside the tube, you see. Now, as you can see, you can't bend your arm, which is very, 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 very good when you're taking a drive with your driver type thing, you see? So, you see? So when you're taking a swing, you want to keep your arms straight, you see? So, you see. I've forgotten this gag. Nearly there. Budgies of prey. <laughs> Just clean the garage, will ya? Clean the garage. Clean the garage. Clean the garage. This is a record. Uh, not just any record. It is. Scratch one, well, obviously, but this record I made in about with my friend Dave Nash made it in 1982. Ice cream man, I think I might have one. I'm gonna have an ice cream. Tidy the garage, tidy the garage. the garage. Ow. Ow. Oof. I didn't think that through. Ow. Tidy the garage. Oof. So anyway, which... So anyway, uh, which one suits me best? The beige... Or the beige. Which do you think? Tidy the garage! Tidy the garage! Yeah. I'd found somebody to tidy the garage. I decided that I would pay Fred. And here we are! Da, 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 da. I managed to make it even worse than when I started. Oh.